<laughs> Be careful there, Sprinter Mutlu. Hello, I'm Mr. Kennan's son, the famous Sprinter Mutlu. Please hold on a second. Now don't you go anywhere. Oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the famous Sprinter Mutlu brought the uh, phone in an instant. Hello. Yes, I am. That's right, it's me. Uh-huh. Uh, ooh, ooh, this is a tremendous honor for me. I will certainly be with you at that ceremony. Thank you so much. Your father has just been chosen Astrophysicist of the Year. I need to prepare my speech for the award ceremony right away, you guys. <laughs> Congratulations, Daddy. That is great How news. awesome! That's my brilliant dad. We need to celebrate with a cake immediately. What are we celebrating? Oh, honey. Dear Sybil, here stands before you the Astrophysicist <laughs> of the Year. <laughs> oh, perfect. Congratulations, dear. Mutlu was right. We need to cut a cake right away. <laughs> I think we even deserve an ice cold lemonade with the cake as well. What do you think? Lemonade and cake, my word! Ah, dear colleagues, I first would like to thank all of you for the attention you've given me and also my work. Mmm, nothing I like more than an ice cold lemonade. How's it going, dear? Not bad at all. I can guarantee they'll be giving me a standing ovation, honey. I believe in you, but you'll get sick and not be able to go anywhere if you don't close the window. Ah, uh, I hadn't really noticed that. I can't think of anything outside of this ceremonious occasion. Here is an ice cold water for my dad. I thought you'd like some. Oh, this is perfect, Mutlu. I need to be in shape for the ceremony. I want to first thank my wife for her undying support, of course, and then also my chil- My children, my chi- My- My children! Uh, hey guys, uh... Can you all play a little bit more quietly while I'm working? I'm sorry, Daddy. We got into this game and forgot the world around us. It's fine, I understand. I want to play around with you guys, too, right after the ceremony's concluded. <laughs> Why is Dad coughing like that, Nashi? I don't know, but I hope he's not going to get sick before the ceremony. everybody like to think. Hey, honey, it's so cold outside. Aren't you freezing, dear? No, I'm just going over and over and over my speech for the ceremony. Ooh. I think you need to come inside and lay down for a while. Don't you worry, dear. Uh, I'll run it a couple more times and then join you inside, all right? <laughs> There he goes. Have you all been sitting here waiting for me all night long? We can't wait any longer to hear your speech, dear. That's, That's right. right. Come, Come on, Dad. Dad. Come on. Oh, I'm sorry to disappoint you guys, but I feel a bit tired. Let's let my speech be a surprise for you all, huh? Keenan, <laughs> dear, are you feeling okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm just a bit tired is all. I'll be fine come the morning sun. Trust me, honey. <laughs> 39 degrees? Ah, oh, sweetheart, I warned you, didn't I? Uh, this is so bad. Don't you think I'll be fine for tonight, honey? Unfortunately, we don't know yet, honey. Wait a minute! My dad's not gonna be able to go and get his award tonight? I wish there was a way for him to attend the ceremony. Ah, oh, kids, I understand, but there's nothing we can do. Health is the most important thing in life. The news is not good, everyone. My dad got sick, and he can't get out of the bed. I hope he gets well soon. He must be very sad now that he can't accept his award.
I wish we could do something for him and get him to that ceremony. Oh, actually, I may have a really good idea. An idea? The kind of idea that will get my dad to the ceremony? We'll at least do the best we can. There's nothing to worry about. See that? Let's enter the last numbers now. Awesome! It's perfect, Minnie! Mr. Kanan can go to the ceremony and get his award now! Come on, then! We need to get out of here before it's late! Here you are, dear. I made linden with honey for you. It'll help you heal. I wish I wouldn't have had that cold lemonade and water as I was sweating, honey. Don't be sad, Daddy. Maybe you'll still have the chance to go tonight. She's right! Minnie told us that she had a really good idea! <laughs> Here we are, Mutlu. I hope we're not too late. Minnie! Nanny! How will you get me to the ceremony when I'm sick like this? <coughs> it's impossible. <coughs> not you exactly, but we can send your hologram there. Hologram, huh? Yep, Mr. Kanon will put this watch on and we'll be able to send his hologram with it. Do you mind pressing the button? Minnie, Manny, this is incredibly impressive. Uh, this is perfect! I want to send my hologram to school tomorrow. <laughs> uh -oh. I want to ask you something. Uh, yeah. My vision is okay, but my voice is gone. Any ideas? <laughs> we'll raise your voice just like this. <clears throat> I want to thank all of you for believing that I deserve this very Yahoo! important award. <laughs> thank you, you wonderful kids. <laughs> You've made me better than ever before. We are now inviting someone very important to the stage to accept his award. He is a scientist who will be attending this ceremony as a hologram because he became quite ill. <clears throat> Good evening, everyone. I first want to thank all of you for believing that I even deserve this award. I want to send all of the love I have to my precious family and to my friends, who always support me no matter what I decide to do. Thank you all so very much. I'm thrilled to feel like a star. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for always being there for us too. Mitty, Maddie, thank you for everything. <laughs> I'll never forget what you've done for me today. <laughs> it's all good. The surprises don't end right now. Look it, this is for you, my brilliant dad. For me, but Nashi. Check it. The best father of the world award. Because you are the most, most super dad in the whole world. Oh, oh kids, this is the best award I've received in my life. Thank you for everything. Somewhere.